Okay, so today I'm going to be reviewing the Revlon Colour Stay Foundation for oily and combinational skin. And I'm going to be doing a review and a demo, so keep watching. So I've got no makeup on at the moment, and today I'm going to be testing the Revlon Colour Stay Foundation. And it's combinational to oily skin, which I have. And there were lots of different shades of this foundation, but I think 180 sand beige suited me quite well because I've got yellow undertones so this is perfect and it's said to last 24 hours which I'm not really sure about because I do a lot in my day and usually foundations just slide off so I'm going to be applying it I'm just going to clip back my hair the thing I don't like about it it's just there's no pump, so it would be quite difficult to get the product out, I think. Only I could get a bit out. Uh, so I've got a bit out, and I'm going to be using my fingers because it's my favourite way of applying foundation. So I've only got moisturiser on at the moment. Quite thick. And it hasn't got a very nice smell either, but it's said to be one of the best full coverage foundations out there. So I'm just gonna blend it down my neck. And I don't like my foundation to be very cakey. So. It's really covering my acne scars. Quite a lot of scars on my forehead as well. So this is one layer, let's try a second. So I like to cover all my acne scars. Okay, so that's two layers of foundation and it seems to have covered most of my blemishes and acne marks so let's just see if it photographs well so it seems quite nice and my skin's not washed out hi guys so I've just finished applying all my makeup and it seems to look really good and the foundation isn't very sticky and it's just settled into my skin and oxidised really well so I'll be checking in a few hours time so I'll see you then, bye! Hi you guys, so I'm just sitting in the car at the moment wait outside my friend Ellie's house waiting for her and my foundation's still really good it has came off a bit around my nose and on my chin but the coverage is excellent and even my mum complimented my skin she said it looked lovely so that's a bonus so it's half past one and I will get to you before I take off at night time bye guys love you I'm about to take off my makeup I've had a long day today and the foundation has done exceptionally well the disadvantage is it hasn't got a pump so it's quite unhygienic and it takes a long time to get the product out and you can actually feel the makeup on your face and it's a bit heavy but it balances it out because it's got brilliant coverage and it's really long lasting and the advantages are it gives amazing coverage all, all my spots and blemishes they're completely covered during the day only my nose and my chin 
and my forehead have faded and I haven't reapplied and the colour match is brilliant once again and it doesn't make me look too orangey or cakey there was no sticky feeling on my face and it just felt smooth and looked really nice so to be honest I really like this foundation and I recommend it so thanks for watching guys I'll link my last video down below love you all bye